Hi friends, in my last video I have shown you how to set up CK editor and CK finder on your Drupal site and today I'm gonna show you how to create your own custom CK editor toolbars. So before that let's take a quick look at all the custom CK editor toolbars which is basic, Drupal basic, Drupal filtered, Drupal full and full. Let's go and check out the basic toolbar which you can see only some basic tools are enabled and on Drupal basic some more tools are added such as image and Drupal filter more tools are added like more styles more tools and on Drupal 4 some more tools are added like color, font size, font style and so on and on full toolbar much more tools are added such as form buttons input forms and you can also maximize the CK editor but you can see that if you wanna embed a YouTube or any other video into your site there is no media embed button enabled on all these toolbars. So let's go back to our site and enable that media embed button. Go to your Drupal Drupal site and on your Drupal site directory go to sites all modules CK editor and CK editor config.js and you can see that the default toolbars are there such as Drupal filter, Drupal basic, Drupal full and so on. And here scroll down to the bottom of the page and you can see that media embed plugin to enable it uncomment the line below and add media embed button to selected toolbar so let's uncomment this and copy the media embed which is the media embed button name and paste it to our toolbar as you can see if you want to enable it we can just copy and paste it to our any of the toolbar like Drupal basic, basic, Drupal filter, Drupal 4 or any other thing but I don't want to change the core system of the CK editor module so let's go and create our own custom toolbar so we just create our custom toolbar so I just comment it as my custom toolbar so that later I can understand it's my custom toolbar okay my custom toolbar and here CK editor dot editor config space equals space function open bracket config close the bracket config dot toolbar space equals space inverter comma my toolbar which is your custom toolbar name you can name it anything you want make sure that you're not leaving any space in between the name my toolbar which is that custom toolbar of mine and config dot toolbar oops uh, 
now you gotta put your toolbar name here config dot toolbar underscore my toolbar space equals space square bracket open and the close bracket and open another square bracket and close the bracket and here we copy and paste the media embed or paste it which we just copied before which is our YouTube media embed button and save the file and make sure that you put the semicolon at the end and go back to our site and go to CK editor profile and toolbar and you can see our custom toolbar which is my toolbar which we just named it and enable that save the file create content page and you can see our new media embed button is there and all other buttons are gone don't worry we will enable it again because this is our custom toolbar and we enabled only media embed button now let's check it whether it's working or not so let's copy our some of the YouTube video embed code okay, I like that okay I copy this mid YouTube video and paste the embed code click OK and you can see embedded media and make sure that you select the full HTML format here oops I didn't put the title put the title too so if you don't put the full HTML format it doesn't work and save and you can see it's working and also make sure that when you enable the custom toolbar if you are on a Drupal basic and if you put the media embed on the Drupal full naturally it doesn't work make sure that you enable the correct toolbar so let's go back to our CK editor config.js and add all other necessary toolbars tools. So let's copy Drupal full toolbar and paste it over our new custom toolbar. Don't worry about the media embed, we will write it again just paste it over that I just want to put it next to the flash because it's a media it's a video related so I better to be next to the flash so we just copy and paste this media embed button next to the flash make sure that next to the media embed you put the space I mean sorry the comma or it doesn't work and save the file and go back to our site and refresh everything is there and all our tools are there and next to the flash our new media embed button also is enabled so that's it thanks for watching